the last stop of the tour. We're here in Pennsylvania, and it's so awesome to be back. PA? I think it's sick. There's so many parks to skate. I don't think we'll be able to do this all this week. I've never been to Woodward, Pennsylvania. Since I started skating, I've been watching the Woodward show, so this is like a dream come true. It's unexpected. I never thought I'd actually be here. I'm flabbergasted. Julian's never seen PA, and like, he is so excited. Like, he is bouncing off the walls. It's so funny. Christian gave me a little tour, which is sick. I got to see all the skate parks firsthand. Julian, you gotta look at the four blocks. It's not big, but it's long. That's the only thing. It's not that long. It's smaller than I remembered. I think it's my favorite part about this place. Target Plaza are the little ledges. All right, hey, this is Egypt. Home to bar is sick. I'm gonna skate the whole time again. <laughs> Dude, this is actually sick. I'm feeling ecstatic. I, I don't know. I got no word, I'm speechless. You know what I mean? You gotta be cringy. <laughs> what? We went to orientation and we're gonna go skate Lot 8 with the Sandlot crew. Everyone was just so excited to skate. Like, none of us even had to warm up because we're just like so excited. Like, you get that feeling where you're just like wanting to go, go, go. Legs is too sleeping. <laughs> it's so hard to keep up with this kid, but I'm trying my best. <laughs> you see how I walk in? No. Watch it. I thought I was gonna die because I locked in like my back toe and my front stroke. It was like opposite cross lock, and then at the end it went to heel. Sketchy. What? We are just one big family. They feel like annoying little brothers now. Yeah, that was yeah weird. you guys I really did. And you're the annoying big sister that's too responsible. Yep, I'm the mom. Where's Kendra? Oh my god, Kendra. Kendra? Kendra right now, she has like a college test or something that she has to take and she can't miss. And so she's back at home right now. She's not in college. What do you, do you have to do is pre-college? What's more important, skating or school? School is more important, for sure. I think the right thing to say is that education is more important, but it is Woodward. Skaters think skating is more important than homework. Kendra. Yeah, she's got to come, man. Ruby, Bombette, and Carlin, like, they're all transition skaters. I miss Kendra to skate street with me. <laughs> she left me hanging with all the transition skaters. Uh, pretty much what I expected to walk into. I'm just getting going. Kids are already ripping. So we're in lot eight right now, and I'm literally trying to warm up by skating this, uh, I don't know, quarter pipe to ledge with Julian. Stoked to be back at Woodward, and hopefully uh, we get to land a lot of tricks, have some fun. Hey, he's a uh, fun type leap over the, over the door. Amazing, amazing. I've only done it on a kit. See? I've only done it in the hip. Yes. That's the future. No, yes. Oh no! I thought that was it! Yeah! Yeah! I actually felt nice. Insane!
my instruction group, bro. Craziest rippers in the world, I swear. So what happens, dude? These kids just get sparked, they spark me. How oh, sick. Wyatt jumped in the session and he was trying to switch Ollie. He kept on clipping the last stair, so I'm like, hey Wyatt, I'm gonna give you an extra speed boost. Put your big boy pants on, come on now. Put your big boy pants on. That was sick. Rails. He don't want food. He's eating rails. Yeah! I have not done stairs before. I just went for it and I landed it. It's so cool. I'll be here all week, man. I'd rather see you skate it than take it off. I'll sign whatever you need. That's right. Thank you. You're welcome. Right here. We went to do paintball, and it was boys versus girls. So me and my brother have never gone paintballing before, and it's just unfair that the girls' team has gone paintballing, but not our team. Please don't kill me. Bro, well, I had a- Wait, Quentin, you're on our team. It's boys versus girls. Julian and Christian were excited at first, and then they started to get like scared and all tense and stuff. It was really funny. <laughs> I was scared. Like yeah, this is my new fit. I've never been so scared. <laughs> 51 start! Oh, the girls are definitely better than the boys at paintball. Yeah! No way! Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! First uh, paintball game won by the girls. Yes! Let's that go. was on me. Let's go, one bet. <laughs> the girls are really good at paintball. I will admit that. Harlan, move up. See, yeah. girls always win. <laughs> I didn't tell everybody else, but I play paintball a lot at home because we have it at our house and we have like this dirt lot that we play on all the time. Whoa, 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 whoa. You have paintball at your house? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just, I wanted to surprise them. Yes! I'm 
never doing that again. I'm like all right at paintball, but like the girls were so good. They smoked us. I had like a bunch of welts and everything. Mia like, she shot me like five times. Mia's got paintball in her backyard at her house. That little Cloud nine right now. I'm warming up the ski jumps with Christian. And uh, we're all like super excited to skate, so we're all like scattered across cloud nine. Like I think the girls are skating the vert ramp. Our buddy Devin Flynn showed up. That's what Devin does every session. He just like goes and skates. Sometimes he says hi, but mostly he's just super quiet. That's why his nickname is, we call him the quiet assassin. Devin is the silent assassin. He is so good, but he doesn't really talk like at all, really. But he's amazing. He's like flying around doing the craziest tricks possible, like nothing. Contact Stonefish, you got it? Yeah. You got it? <laughs> yeah, I got Are it. Are you sure you got it? Talk to him though. Sure. And if I don't make it first try, you can throw me down the resi. Oh, perfect. Oh! Carlin's going in the resi, I guess. Double or nothing. I've been wanting to learn fakey front, big heel. It's called a Rick flip. Fine, it's called a Rick flip, but it sounds- For who? Rick who? Rick Howard, legend. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was called the Rick flip, but I didn't like to call it like that because I just thought it sounded like cooler and more complicated if I said it like the longer version. But Manny like totally called me out on it. The Rick Flip is named after Rick. I don't know. <laughs> so the Rick Flip is named after Rick Howard, which I didn't know. But Manny told me. Shout out to Rick Howard for this awesome trick. I did Vero Heel last year, but this is like a completely new trick for me. I've never done this before. You're flicking and throwing. You gotta throw, flick. Okay. Like you gotta guide the big spin and then flick it at the end. What? Yeah. Manny just told me to like worry about the spin and then the flick. And I didn't really like fully understand why, but I tried it and it like totally worked. It's so awesome to have someone with so much experience like giving you tips and like helping you learn your new tricks. You were so right! You it did worked. it! You did it! I'm just the voice of reason. I'm gonna land this right now, right here. Let's try. Let's try, let's try. A 
lot of girls from my cabin were there hyping me up. We were just having so much fun skating the hip. The energy was super good. It was just so much fun. All right, I'm trying full cap flip right now. Yeah, I learned a lot of tricks on the Lot 8 hip, but I mean, it lends itself to it. I was really happy to learn both of those new tricks. The battle is like always like making sure you keep those new tricks and not it just being like a one-time thing. So Mia's like, Carlin, try this real. You just have to like get your weight on it. That's the scary part. But like once you do that, it's like pretty easy. Just grim, I'm going up. I'm going up. to Egypt we're gonna start off by skating the long rail. So excited to go into Egypt. I haven't skated in a year and it's my favorite park here. Oh, I got her back. Instead of skating the bumped bar like we always do, we decided to skate the long down rail. Sweet. I board slid it. And then I 50 it too. I thought it'd be cool to like start with it this year because that's how I ended it last year. That was pretty good. Feels so good to be back here. It's bittersweet because I'm having so much fun with these guys and I don't want it to end but we're gonna make it a good week. On the next episode of season 12. There's a bump to barrier jam going on at the rock. It's like my favorite obstacle to skate, so I'm super excited. Wow.
and slides, and then after time runs out, then they flip the barrier to the side so you can skate over it.